Welcome back, YouTube. It's okay, Maul. Today marks episode five of our Spell Sword build. The objective today is just to knock out a couple more contracts so we can get one step closer to the troll fight. With that being said, we do have to rest for the night. It looks like uh, I ended the last episode without resting. And our guy is a little fatigued from the looks of it. Yeah, 20% fatigue. He's not having a good day. All right. Well, let's go rest up. All right, we're now fully rested, so let's go ahead and talk to the Elder. The next quest is going to be at the Ominous Ruins. And uh, the objective is to head to the Cenobium of the Goiding Hand, which is directly south of us. So I'll meet you guys down there. All right, we just arrived at a Cenobium of the Guiding Hand. The objective, kill the cult leader. Oh, we have a trap right off the bat. Let's head this way first. We have a bat and a uh, liquor boy. Let's see here. Let's do number six. Zappy zap. Apparently I I missed. Fantastic. Okay, he's dead. Another little zappy boy. Come to me. Let's hit him with a little bit of uh come to me. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We, we're going to level really, really quickly. Um, we were going into Vitality, were we not? I think we were. As far as the next ability points. I will have to wait. To unlock it. Yeah, I'm going to have to wait. I have to buy the books. Yeah. No worries. We'll uh we'll buy into it. It's fine. Uh yep, take that. Wardrobe empty. Okay, there's an enemy. He saw us before we saw him. Oh, and a boomer. Wait a minute. This is Manshire. That's a tier three, isn't it? That's not good. It's really not good. I don't like this at all. He's gonna spit at me, I'm sure. Yep. Okay. Kinda figured he'd spit. I don't know what to do here, other than wait for him to get close to me. Not cool. Seventy-eight percent. He's bleeding. Okay, how much HP did he get back? Seventy percent still. We got a dip. Ooh. <laughs> I don't like those guys. Um, wow. It's not expecting that. All right, let's heal up. I'll head back in. And number four. Good crit. Good crit. There we go. Whew. You're kidding me. I'm not ready for this. Alright, y'all. Since it's spotting tier threes, um, I don't think I'm ready for this. Uh, I might end up just failing this. It's kind of the, it's kind of the idea here. Um, unless I go back to town and get some more traps and try it then, but... Bruh, I, I, I'm not prepared. <laughs> oh, I am not prepared for this. What? Gross. Um. Okay. So be it. Let's just fail it. Let's just go to Osbrook. We'll knock out a couple more contracts over there. All right, y'all. We're back at Osbrook. 
Uh, we'll just go ahead and do quests here for right now. Alright y'all, we just made it at the cold burial. Objective being kill the necromancer and find the source of light. I'm thinking I won't really cut in the entirety of this dungeon. Probably just like close fights, uh, the boss, and any good loot. But outside of that, we'll make it nice and quick. Wow, there's a trap already. Let's loot this sarcophagus. Not too bad. Okay, we do have a chest here. Um, I'll leave that behind. And the boss room right below us. Number six. Number five. We'll run up on them. Seven. There we go. Nicely done. Perfect. Easy peasy. No ghost, good deal. Get rid of that. And no ghost. There is no end game loot or end dungeon loot, unfortunately. But we'll move on. Oh my goodness, we just found a secret room. Let's freaking go. I'm gonna run. Enchantment scroll, a folio. Uh, let's see here. Grab the folio, grab the enchanting scroll. Bookcase carries nothing. What's this one got? I'll read this one at least. Alright, hopefully the chest got something good. Hmm. Not the best. I mean, I got two enchanting scrolls off of it. Silver plate, a blue ring. Gold, which we'll go ahead and merge. Ah, that's disappointing, actually. Hmm. Dang. So sad, so sad. Well, let's move on. Okay, we have another chest. Get this opened up. Um, huh. 120, what's this worth? 100, 196. A little bit of a predicament here. This probably won't sell that well. Let's drop it. Yeah, we have another chest to loot. Let's see what's inside. I apparently can't pick a lock. All right, just some brandy. Um, actually, if I reorganize, ah, I'm off by one. <laughs> I was thinking maybe I can go back and grab that uh, spear now, but hmm, I'll grab the brandy instead. All right, so this is a very small dungeon. Not a whole lot to see here. We did have the secret room, but uh, honestly, that's it. All right, we're back to see the elder. Hand in the rewards. Perfect. Get more work. Walk away. Next one's going to be down to the south. Let's head over there next. All right, we just read at Fortress Raven Wards, and uh, we're going to kill the brigand leader next. Same idea as the last one, only going to cut in the important stuff. Ooh, looks like we found a blue here. Actually, two uh, unidentified items. I won't be taking them because, eh, garbage, but still. Um, we got a close fight here. Let's see how easily we can ta handle this, right? Oh, that <laughs> didn't work the way I planned it. Wait for him to come to us. Oh, I still stepped. Oh, well. Easy peasy. Oh, nice. You dropped a quiver for us. Good job, guy. Got another chest here to loot. I'll take it. Okay, here's the boss room. What we're gonna do, I'm gonna probably back off a little bit. He's gonna start shooting at me. I'm gonna use his arrows to knock into the boss cause you know what's gonna happen. Yep. He's gonna die. <laughs> dead, dead, dead. We're gonna get a little bit closer. Oh, what? Stop moving, dude. There we go. Easy peasy. Loot the rest of this room here. At least this one has a final chest. Go ahead and pick it. 
Um, things that I don't need on me right now. So merge that, drop. I'll probably drop that too. Reorganize, move this around, and I can grab everything else. There we go. But eats. Fantastic. All right, y'all, that'll do it for this dungeon. It is again, another very, very small dungeon. Like, here's the boss room we were just in. That's it. Like, there's hardly anything in here. And that's all my loot. All right, back to see the Elder. Give me my next reward, followed by the next contract. There we go, fare thee well. This one here is going to be located just north of us. We'll head that way next. All right, we just arrived. Our objective this time, kill the cult leader, as well as grab the old census records. Trap right off the bat. Oh, we have some uh, bookcases here to loot. Already read that. Ooh, what's this? Go ahead and read. Let's go. Uh, old candlestick. Don't need that, though. Okay, it's empty and empty. Uh, chest contains not a whole lot. Can I use this? Sure can. Okay, you have another chest. Um, we'll take everything there. We have another one of these rings, and it's also an unidentified blue. Very nice. So we will have a basement level. All right, we just found an identity scroll. So let's go ahead and use it on this ring. Ring gives us health. Experience extra energy and energy restoration. Huh. Not too bad. Okay, we're at the boss room. We'll run up on him real quick. Zap him in the face. Nice. Fall back. Awesome. He's dead. He didn't even stand a chance. Uh, the chest, what's in here? Uh, things that we don't need. Eat, eat, reorganize, and I gotta drop something else to the ground. We'll drop that. This up, that there. Bam. Wardrobe's empty. And another ID scroll, which we can use right now. Rage. Nice. Alright, y'all, this dungeon's now completed. Uh, not a bad haul, actually. Pretty decent amount of valuables here. Uh, but anyway, I'll meet you guys back in town. All right, now that we're back in town, we'll talk to the Elder, get our last contract completed. Fantastic. And now it's time to sell all of our gear. All right, Bert, what's up, dude? Sell, sell, sell. Uh, sell that, sell this ring, sell, sell, sell. Um, energy restoration and energy, it's not a bad ring overall. I don't think I'm going to need it for this particular build, so we're going to go ahead and sell it. He's down to 172 for gold. The books are coming with me to Manshire, ultimately to Bryn, but we won't sell those here. The rest of the stuff I actually dropped to the ground. I didn't sell anything else um, throughout those three contracts. So let me go ahead and merge this together. Drop that. Drop these to the ground. Reorganize, and we'll pick everything else up. All right, Bert got more to sell. Whatever I can get away with, that's it. That's all Bert can take. But I will buy an ID scroll. We'll use it on this one. This one gives us a bleed and nature resistance. So we'll have to sell it to somebody else. Bert now has 47 gold. So I can sell this. Mr. Blacksmith. Take, 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 take everything. Uh, blacksmith is now broke. 102 and 102? How often does that happen? He's got zero coinage. Awesome. Awesome. And lastly, we're going to sell everything else to this guy. Fantastic. We're done. All right, y'all. I think we're ready to head back to Manshire. This is all of the loot that we're going to be taking with us. Like I said, the books are going to be going to Bryn eventually. So we can make the most amount of money selling them. All right, y'all. The last thing we do before we're going to log off today. We look in our backpack. I got all the books that I could possibly carry right now. Actually, if I uh, drop that, I can actually grab the last book. <laughs> there we go. And now we're going to head on down to Bryn. All right, y'all, we just made it to Bryn. 
Go ahead and show me your goods here. Sell, 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 sell. Still got a lot of gold left on them. Go ahead and open this up next. There we go. What you got? Sell, 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 sell. All right, there's a few things we need, right? We needed the Electromancy Treaty 2 and Magic Treaty 2. Magic Treaty Mastery 2 right there. Cool. I'm going to go ahead and read. Nice. And read. Fantastic. Sell, sell. The next things I need to do, we go into our abilities. I'm going to get the residual charge. So it'll grant our weapon more weapon damage, as well as casting the ability, uh, Electromancy ability tree. We'll get 15.4% weapon damage at Delta Shock. So grab that up. The next level up, we'll be getting um, body and spirits. So that should help us out a lot as well. Our next stop is going to be the Carpenter Bailiff. Just talk to him real quick. And now we got to go talk to Bert. And Bert will get us the recommendation letter. All right, Bert. Uh, I need your help with something. There we go. We just got the recommendation letter. And while we're here, do you have anything worth it? Ooh, it's not bad. The long gibbons. I want a light one or do I want something heavier? Doesn't really, I mean, other than adding a bit more protection, it doesn't really add much else to my repertoire, honestly. I'm going to pass on that. All right, this is my next stop. I need to buy two of these. We'll end up getting one of these for free in Guile's office, so I only need two at the moment. Okay, go ahead and talk to the bailiff. Here's a letter from the quartermaster. Done and done. Talk to Guile next. All right, guy, I'll part of the interruption. I have a letter from the quartermaster. And that'll be three bottles of elven ice wine. While nobody's in here, we're going to actually steal that right now. There we go. All right, our last stop is this gentleman right here. I have a letter from them from Burn. And that should be a thousand crowns. Perfect. I don't want to pay him just yet because I don't think he has anything worth getting at this stage in the game. All right, y'all. It's finally time. Talk to Guile. Here's what you asked for. Farewell. Um. So what went missing today? Hopefully it's a good sword. That's basically what I'm here for. Uh. What's this? Uh. Twenty. That's it. What's this one? 25 accuracy goes down bumble chance block chance body part damage and armor penetration all right y'all i'm probably gonna pass on this sword i went online looked up some other uh, weapons that are available at my level and there are a couple better options so we'll wait for him to reset his uh, inventory before we make a decision now i wasn't gonna do this but i changed my mind so we'll give him a thousand gold and uh see what he has well as i figured he has no upgrades for us. Not really, at least. Dang, that stinks. So what we'll end up having to do is head back to Manshire and uh, do more contracts. All right, let's go ahead and talk to Varen. Get his uh, little tasks completed. All right, let's head in. What happened here? Yeah, nobody knows what happened, bro. Okay, go ahead and grab the journal entry. Read, discard it. Look at all the uh, icons that we can. And I think this one here. There we go. Okay, we'll uh, grab the bookshelf. Oh, <gasps> wouldn't you know it? There's a secret entrance. Gets me every time. Would have never guessed. Okay, go ahead and read, 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 drop these off here because we are not going to need them. Take that, Let's take the Morian, uh, no valuables, and next thing I do is just look at a couple things here, and there we go, he's going to be happy. Uh, 
All right, all that's done. I'll get uh, now that all of that is finished, we can meet back in Manchester. All right, y'all, that'll do it for today's episode. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, share the channel with your friends, family. I'll catch y'all next time. Bye.